So guys, Smock just released the new device called the Nord. We did a review on it. It's pretty sweet. But a lot of people have been wondering, is it really worth the upgrade from the Novo to the Nord? So we're here to answer that question yeah. today. Alright, so there are a couple major differences in these two devices. One namely being that the Nord is much larger than the Novo. Mm -hmm. um, and it also has a button. Right. The two big. And then on top of that, it's replaceable coils, not the entire pod. That's right, and so that means that you actually have options whether or not you um, you have two different coil options as opposed to the Nova, which has one pod option that you get. Yeah. You put it in. With the Nord, you have the option for both salt nick and regular nick, uh, depending on the coil you decide to put in it. However, on the Novo, you only have salt nick options. Coming with the large size of the Nord, it has a much bigger battery, and the pod size is actually an extra milliliter compared to the Novo. Um, and then what the price difference here is about ten bucks about ten dollars. Yeah mm -hmm. Putting that the Novo's battery is less than half right correct. It's, it's less than half of the Nord's battery and then the fact that the Nord has a bigger pod just more options and in my opinion it hits nicer. Oh, which yeah, it's crazy because oh, the, yeah. the Novo was a device that was a best hitting device for mm -hmm. us for a long time. It was top one to three every month since we've got it. And the Nord, it, you know, they built it, it, if you look at them, they're just, they look just the same. So they mm -hmm. built it just like the Novo. So the hit should be very similar. At the end of the day, you get a lot more for a little bit more. Exactly, you know, I would say that the hit on the Nord definitely uh, is similar, more similar to that of something like the Orion than it is of the Novo. It's a lot harder, but it still has amazing flavor, which is excellent. Mm -hmm. Now, we do have salt nick in the mesh coil, which, you know, they don't recommend, but I don't really care. It tastes amazing, and yeah. the cloud is incredible, and... I've not had any issues with harshness or anything like that either. I, I just think they don't recommend it because nobody does, but it's exactly. weird that nobody does. We'll probably do a video on that next week to let you know why. Yeah, <laughs> you'll see. Monday. Monday, but yeah, so if you are interested in upgrading or you want to get involved with one of these two devices, definitely check out the Nord. We've got links for these both down below for good prices. Um, the Nord is something that I think is a game changer, really, because it, it brings you so many, like, good features and an incredible hit for really not that much money. It's only 30 some bucks right now, which yeah. is great. Yeah, it is great. I mm -hmm. I also, I believe that the Nord is the better option here. Um, <clears throat> prices that we've found indicate that it's not that much more expensive than the Novo. Exactly, and it's, it's just a bigger, better package. Battery life <laughs> yeah. lasts longer, bigger cloud, bigger buzz, better yeah. flavor. I would even go as far as to say that the Nord competes with the Orion and devices yeah. like that, which mm -hmm. the Novo doesn't quite do. Yeah, know? exactly. So, and for only 32 bucks or so, it's totally worth something you should check out. Yeah. Um, well, that's about all we got to say on this, guys. Links for both these are down below, like we said. Um, check them out. I mean, definitely consider upgrading to the Nord from the Novo, because it is, in my opinion, definitely worth it. Yeah, I mean, if you like the Novo, the Nord is just a bigger, better one. Yep. So do that, hit that subscribe button, drop a like, do all the goods, and until next time, boys and girls, peace, peace out. out.